Ayo, pretty strange out there. I'm sorry, I, I, I lost track. Something amazing happened. Well, I, I thought of something amazing. You, you were klutz, oh. Let me help you. What are you doing, huh? You holding out on me? You drinking? You ruining your hard work. Mind the rules. Huh, what'd you say? Nothing. I knocked it over on purpose. Why you do that? Because you're pissing me off. Come on, oh. This right. I know you serious about this building stuff. Opal! I'm sorry, it's, it's late, I know, but, but some things happen on the way back. I got you some stuff. You can go through them when you, <laughs> you okay? You should see up top, oh, it's crazy. No one around Ghost Town. We could be the only ones left. Well, saw some people, but we the only ones brave enough to stay. Well, stupid enough. I said I was sorry. Come on. Someone came around. Who? Highland smokes. They smoke. <laughs> Can't believe you finished all of yesterday. What a... Maybe these are help. Help what? Your meanness. Don't like it. You ain't got to say. But I will say, because I'm devoted. You will remember my pops left my mom and I found me on the couch. Whispered he was leaving. 
our sport. God damn it, I know this already. Well, if somebody's got to carry the conversation all the time, then they gotta repeat themselves. Anyway, I was four. Pop said he wasn't leaving my mom. Yeah, he wasn't leaving me, he was leaving my mom, but he said I was all right. <laughs> Funny how he said it all right, but your mother, she's a cunt. That, that's what he said. And, uh, he left. Mom acted like she ain't know the difference. She was out of damn mind anyway, but I, I saw her through. I saw her through to the end, so I ain't leaving. D -bo Ted. It's important you know that about me. I ain't had a wash yet. I can tell. Whose fault is it? And what you gonna do about it? Your mother. Your word. Get to it. Whew. It's been a day, huh? I didn't ask you. Well, I, well I, I, I'm going to tell it because it needs to be heard. Oh, oh. Oh. What is it? I forgot to ask you about the rest of yours. I woke up, took a shit in that bucket over there, it paced around, worked, paced around some more. You need to get out, though. I'm tired of saying that. Well, can you remember the last time you was out of this hole? Oh, you too. I do. Just keep building it, Tony. You'll never guess who I saw. Oh, well, first, first I should tell you, I found, guess what? Yes! I started the morning the way I normally do, right? Prepared the car, had my breakfast, left you breakfast, and, and I left, made my way through the shanty. Everybody mostly gone, except for, uh, except for a few stragglers. And, and just as soon as I'm done saying my mornings and my hellos to people, I step out the can, I look down. Now guess. Oh, five bucks! <laughs> what are you talking about? I found five bucks. What did you get us with? Well, idiot. Oh, ooh, let me explain. You simple nigga. I saw Lisa, oh. your friend. Lisa, you remember her? You two was close. Like a flea and a cat. Oh, well, you were. <laughs> well, she asked about you. And I told her you never know with her, and we laughed about that. But I saw Lisa out on the street, just passing each other. But she was telling me how she was in the shelter for months, but all her stuff was stolen. And, and she knew who it was, so you know Lisa. Of course, she choked somebody like she always be doing, and they, they threw her out on the street, the shelter. You believe that? I don't want to hear it. Well, I, but she was begging, and, and she she found out she can't come back to the shanty because of the clean out tomorrow, and, and, and then this, this, this pisses me off. She got a ticket, a ticket for begging. How to make any damn sense? A ticket for what? Now she got to beg to pay the fine, and what? So I, I gave her the fine. I gave it to her. I, I can't say no to somebody hungry, somebody begging. What? What? Why you around? <laughs> <laughs> around you? <laughs> it's five dollars, though. It's five I would have never had had I never found it, so I figured it never existed in the first place. Mm, you always doing this! And nobody likes oh, you. true. Because you're always begging them for stuff. Asking people for things, for money you give till it hurts. No, I don't. You gave Gilbert, you told me, the shirt off your back the other day. That's generosity. Kindness to your fellow man. It was raining that day. Then you asked him the next day if he could pay you ten bucks for it. It wasn't raining the next day. Came home mad, shirt in hand, pissed. He couldn't pay you for it. Nobody got nothing around here. And if you got nothing, you got nothing. 
More reason to give, I think, when nobody got. Money's tight in the shanty, you right. So we share what we got, we trade, we beg, we borrow, we don't own. We won't own the way you act. When I give it to you, then you could have given me five bucks. Ain't I out there every morning at the crack of dawn till five at night, begging, crushing cans, scooping out garbage, raking the streets, bring you crap for your project. I don't need you. Then how are you going to do it? Huh? Well, I ain't, I'm not doing I happen to be excited about something, and I'm looking to tell you what it is. You got other things. I'm your penance. You said it. 